shame. So that wasn't even recording, and I just had a full-on conversation with myself. <laughs> shame. Anyway, kia tato ko rei rei tēnei. Coming at you from Little Town Morua up here in the Bay of Islands in Tithai Tokirau. I am director of Akuringa and Solid is our clothing label. Solid is 5, 6, and 7XL. Kakahu made for comfort. So if you're a 5, 6, or 7XL or know someone who's a 5, 6, or 7XL, like, share, tag, comment, and join our event up above. So uh, this is a bit of a recap of the Kahao program called Ines Wai Tikai Kurero o Tenei Po. He wahine tino a tāhua, he, he wahine tino kaha, he wahine whakaui a wiki au nei. Um, I e toringa mea e tino hirehire i roto i tana kōrero, ko te mea tōtahi, uh, ko te, te value. So there was three things that she talked about tonight, and the the first thing she talked about, or the that she gave us insight to, was how a value ladder works. Making up little packages and increasing the value of our products um, and then increasing the price, which is going to be a little bit hard because I don't have that many products yet, and it's going to require a lot of out-of-the-box out thinking, and I struggle to think inside the box. I don't even know if I have a box, but we'll see how we go. I'll make it work somehow. Te mea tō, tō rua, te mea tino hira hira tō rua, um, wairua, siakina tō wairua. Something that Ines spoke about was look after your wairua, um, Money is not enough to sustain your business. Mehe mea kore pai to wairua. So, money is not enough to sustain your business if, you're, if, you're, if your wairua isn't good. And this is something that I probably, I need to listen to, I need to take heed to. Now, this is something that uh, I struggle with a lot. Um, I tend to take on a lot of different things. Um, that's the way my mind thinks. So I'm prone to burnout. I am prone to fatigue. I am prone to breakdowns. Um, that part really resonated with me. Si akina te wairua. Um, and probably something that I need to focus a little bit on more. Um, but, um, Inez, if you're watching this, last year you gave a beautiful quarter on procrastination and, um, breakdowns and stuff like that. And you talked about blocking in. Now, this is something that I've lived by. So I was, yeah, I was really lucky to hear your quarter last year. And you talked about booking in time for your whanau and time for self-care. I remember you saying that you block in family time. Um, which I, something I sort of failed on last year, but this year, and I block in so much time for this subject, so much time for this course, so much time, so an hour, and I task every hour, so this hour, I'm going to work on only emails for this business, also, you know, you gave something, you gave a really awesome quarter on about it last year, and actually, I want to, mihi ana ki aku mo tēnei rautaki, because that is something that I have lived to, learn to survive with. Ko te mea hera hera tua toru, uh, ko te take. What is your why? Okay, so my reasons and my why. And you said stay strong to your why. So my why for coming into business was to be suspect. And I've got it all over my Facebook page, all over every video that I said is I want to be successful enough to support others. Now whether that is my kākahu making someone else feel comfortable, whether that is my kākahu being affordable. Five, six, and seven XL clothing is not cheap. So I wanted to make my clothing affordable for whānau. Um... Whether that is being able to hire someone else, whether that's um, getting enough income that I can support community events. It's even in Moirua, we have a massive as community base here, and if I can support somehow financially, or I don't know if I can support somehow, um, that's success for me. So that was my, my take. So the, the reason why I started, or kote take te matai, was um, I had a really good friend of mine who couldn't find clothes to fit and that were comfortable. And I was like, bro, I can make that. Like, why didn't you tell me? Like, I've been sewing since I started primary school, you know? Like, Nana had me on a sewing machine before I went on the school bus. Um, that is where solid come from. So I made sure that my t-shirts were made longer. I made sure that, the, you know, like, they had comfortable, the material was comfortable. Um, I wanted to make sure that my friends and whanau had kākuhu. One, that they could feel comfortable in. Two, that they could look nice in. And three, that they can afford. Ko tēra taku tino, tino hira hira kiauni. Uh, five, six, and seven XL. So we think we're looking clothes that that aren't on the market or clothes that are super expensive. So that's what started me onto this. Um, and I got into that, and then Kaho came up, and I was like, boom, there's my opportunity. Naraida, kotera taki kore o te porne. Neo te kifaka miha te kia koe te ihu pumano i te puhi kaka kura. Mau i i manaki i amato i ngā akunga o te, o te kahau program uh, i tēnei tau. Nā reira e mihi ana ki a koe e Ines. Ai, 
and that ate at Pomadie. Solid. 5, 6, and 7 XL. Kakahu made for comfort. So if you're a 5, 6, or 7 XL or know someone who's a 5, 6, or 7 XL, like, share, tag, and comment. Join our event launching on the 4th of December. Mariora.